How's it going everyone? Matt with Final Rise here. Wanted to make a short video and walk you guys through the process of swapping out your game bag. Now there's a lot of people that run a full size vest, whether that's the Summit XT, the Summit or the Legacy during hunting season because they want the ability to transport a dog if needed. Uh, but switching over to training season or even going on a particular hunt where maybe there's a guide or you don't need to be able to carry a bunch of different stuff, you're not as worried about the dog, you actually have the ability to swap out game bags. All the components in our vests are sewn individually. The waist belts, the shell pouches, the water bottle holders, everything is an individual component because we have so many different sizing variables to accommodate the different needs of folks out there. Once we get an order, we compile all those together, we assemble your vest and build it out. But what that allows you to do is be able to have the modularity and the ability to be flexible in that configuration. So if you have, again, a full size vest and you want to swap it out to a sidekick game bag, you have the ability to do so. So we'll say you've got a summit here and we're going to swap this out. You're going into training season or you're going on a quail hunt or doing something different and you just need a more minimal bag. So when you order the game bag specifically from uh, finalrise.com, this is how it's going to come to you. It's going to have the lumbar pad already built in there and it's going to include the rear yoke. So detaching the existing game bag from the harness and everything else is, is very, very easy. And so first thing we're going to do is we need to take the harness off. All you do, this is a continuous, this is one piece of webbing that is fed from the mesh panel end of the vest comes through the G-hook, routes through the harness, and comes back down through one of these sliders. So we release that, just feed that webbing through, and now the front end of our harness is free. Now we, if we want to run the sidekick with the harness, we would just leave the front part attached. Now you can run the sidekick without a harness, so if you want to remove that entirely, you're welcome to do so, but for time's sakes in this video, we're just going to swap it over and repurpose everything that's already on the waist belt. First thing we're going to need to detach is we have the lumbar pad here that is Velcroed down. So we will open that up. That gives us access to the waist belt itself. Then you will need to go to the side of the game bag right behind the water bottle holders. There's a ladder lock. There's webbing that's fed from your waist belt to the game bag. It's gonna give it lateral stability and hold that bag flush to your back. There's one of those on either side. And now your game bag is free so you're obviously going to want to keep this in a safe place i'm assuming you're hopefully going to want to hunt with it a little bit more in the future but for the summer you don't need it so you can set that aside and we'll come over to the sidekick game bag and all we're simply going to do is the reverse of what we just did there so it's usually easiest to do the velcro first you can just line these two patches up the cutouts of the Velcro are the exact same size, so you'll basically just sandwich together the male and the female Velcro together to secure the center of it. Then you will find the forward-facing ladder lock on the side of your sidekick game bag. You'll take the webbing that comes from your waist belt, you'll feed him through, and you'll cinch that down to your personal sizing and liking. We'll do that on both sides of the game bag really quick. Once finished, it'll look like that. Your bag's attached there. Now we have the rear yoke that is sticking up from inside. All we'll do is we'll make sure that the harness isn't twisted or anything like that. I'm gonna take the webbing. We've got that loop right there. Feed it through. And all you're gonna do is route it through these two particular locations. Now you you're probably going to need to set your torso length. Obviously you've just transitioned from a full size game bag that has a panel and everything here. So it's not gonna be a mere replica of that. You can set it up so that it can be, um, but you'll, you'll have to play with it a little bit to get your torso length dialed in. And on the note of torso length, one thing to mention, just because there isn't a mesh panel or portion of the game bag here, it makes the sidekick a great option for youth or even shorter women. Because realistically, I can take this harness and put it all the way to the game bag. And so if there's shorter people out there, this is a really great solution. And we actually sell a lot of these to women and kids that are getting into it. So then from there, like I said, you can reload all your gear back into the vest, weigh it down. You're probably gonna need to set your torso length, but everything's ready to rock and roll. So 
If I wasn't talking or being long-winded trying to explain that, that would literally take me maybe two minutes tops to be able to swap that out. When I'm ready to go back to my full-size game bag, I would just repeat that process and I'm ready to rock and roll. So that is how you convert your full-size vest to a Summit and vice versa. If you guys have any questions, feel free to reach out, support at finalrise.com. And we've got a phone number on the website. If you call, we'll answer. Happy to answer your questions. Appreciate you watching.